The issue is not just kind of average change of global warming that is a, a seven degree or four degree or two degree rise. A two degree would be in centigrade is a bad rise. Four degree is catastrophic and six degree is calamitous. My name is Peter Schwartz. I'm the Senior Vice President for Global Government Relations and Strategic Planning of Salesforce.com. I don't think we just have to rely on value change. I think economics is in our favor. Stanford actually studied the implications in terms of energy savings if you move to this shared platform off of building your own data centers, building your own machines, all that kind of stuff. Even if you don't have your own data center, having a, a rack of computers in a closet and so on. Instead of operating on us, which are internet enabled, you basically just use a browser on any device. You save 90% of the energy. It's a 90% saving. That's what the implication is. It's profound. It's not a marginal saving. It's a step functional change. It's an order of magnitude change. There are a bunch of young people whose values uh, 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 engage in sharing, and that's wonderful. Then there's some very well-off people, uh, uh, older age, who love the idea of sharing, and that's great, and those values are important. But in the world of business, and for the great majority of people, the reason they want to share is that it's economical that it's the, the cheapest, best solution to whether it is a business problem or a travel problem or a personal mobility problem. Uh, and, uh, you know, to be honest, to rely simply on virtue is, I think, uh, to uh, make life a bit more difficult. For the great majority of people, uh, it, it, you know, in all honesty, if they had the choice and the money, they would probably go first class and they would probably uh, have their own stuff. But the truth is, for 60, 70, 80 percent of the population, the economics uh, favor the idea of sharing. I think one of the challenges, and you mentioned you don't use your zip car for going to work, is actually urban redesign in this case, i.e. to facilitate uh, the kind of sharing that you're talking about. A greater density enables that. Uh, the suburbs make it that much more difficult. You know, if you really have to use a car to take your kids to school, it makes that much life that much more difficult and so on. So I, I think some of the work on sustainable communities and walkable communities in particular is very important. If you can walk to a lot of things, then it becomes much more easily available when you can't to use a zip car and so on. So I think this is not just simply a consumer issue, this is a business issue. And I love Robin's uh, slide of the two slides of the, the, the peer incorporated. Uh, that slide is a new business model. Uh, it's a way to do business, not just with consumers, but with other businesses as well. Mm -hmm.